another thing that is very handy inside of the sequence view is actually hiding different elements or different sequences. And to do that, there's a little eyeball that's located in front of each color sequence. And if you select it, it will hide anything in that color sequence. So I can bring it back by clicking the eyeball again. You'll just notice that it's very simple to select the eyeball for a color sequence and turn those stitches off. Now, the times that you'll utilize this is when you're really trying to analyze a design to make sure that everything is there that it needs to be. Um, or if you're gonna create another element, sometimes it's nice to hide something so that you can really focus in the area that you want to. So the other thing that you're able to do with the Floriani software is utilize something called the ghost tool. And it's located in the bottom left hand side of the toolbar. And if I select it, what it will do is it will actually hide, it will, it will ghost anything that's hidden. So if I come in here and I hide everything other than that blue right here, if I have that selected, if I hit the ghost tool now, you'll notice that everything else shows up in white. I can turn the 3D view off if I want or on. With it on, you can kind of see the detail. The nice thing about this is that it allows you to really focus in on an area. At the same time, you're able to see the stitches that are included in the design. So if you're adding an element, it makes it easy to, let's say I'm just gonna make this into applique. I could have this ghosted and now I could just create my line right down the middle of this um, steel stitch border and it makes it just really easy to do, really easy to see those stitches. So it's just another really handy way to utilize the sequence view. As you can see, I'm just kind of clicking around just to show you that it makes it easy and it makes it much easier than if you're in here seeing all of the the true color in here. Sometimes it can be hard to um, locate the middle. It's just it's just an easy, you can see how that gets hidden there. Um, it just makes it a lot easier. So the sequence view, selecting objects is very easy and also hiding them and then bringing them back. It's another powerful tool when utilizing the sequence view.